Hello BC, hello Valley Community, how y'all doing? Um, Danny Valor, I'm 69, back here again. I'm uh, going to do a quick response video to Robert Z's thread. Um, how you doing Robert, you are, right, Keep up the magic videos, they're cool, really cool. Um, just two questions in the um, in thread. Um, songs you just can't bear to listen to anymore. Um, there's a few of them. I don't own many of them though, uh, but there's a lot. Uh, but uh, the, the, just the main one, well there's, I'll pick three basically. Three songs that I could just live quite happily the rest of my life without ever hearing again, ever. Um, and uh, this is them, this is them. So the first one is uh, Nirvana, Smells Like Teen Spirit, if I, this is my thinking right, if I own it on vinyl, I'll never have to listen to it again. I just, I, I own it now, it's, it's, it goes in a little box up there and it never gets played. And I never have to listen to this song ever again. So, uh, I like the B-side though, Drain Me, Drain Me is good but I never want to hear this song again. Next up, Anarchy in the UK by the Sex Pistols. Yeah, it, you know, I'll talk more about the Sex Pistols in a minute but um, yeah when it came out it was shocking, it was uh, a sort of awakening call for most people or whatnot. I just don't want to ever hear it again. I'm sick of this, like the opening riff. The -na 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 -na. Don't want to hear it ever again. No, no. Don't want to hear people covering it. Shh, no, 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 no. And uh, the last one, <laughs> I've shown this before, I've talked about how I don't like this album. I especially don't like the opening track. Um, London Calling by The Clash. The song London Calling gets overused and overexposed, and everybody's used. It was in the fucking Olympics for Christ's sake, you know. Um, just ah oh, no, no. So those are the songs I could. Those are the three songs I could live without never ever hearing ever again um there was a second part to the contest uh thread so it's not a contest sorry it's a thread i'm all over the place today um like time travel it's like you can go back and you can live in a an era you know um if you could time travel back you could live in any era where would you live? Right, I've given a lot of thought about this, right, and I know exactly what I'd do and where I'd go. So, we'd start off in um, 76, 1976, and we would, uh, let me just check. Yeah, 1976. So we'd start off in 1976, and we'd start off in New York, um, and I basically, I just in 1976 hang around CBGBs in New York and just watch the Ramones and television, Patti Smith, um, and, uh, Richard Hell and the Voidoids. You know, people like that. I just hang around there. Suicide, people like that. So then, um, end of '76, get a plane, travel over to London see uh, the Clash and the Sex Pistols uh, and the Damned, oh hang on a minute, and the Damned. Why aren't you just there? Why isn't it just there? Damn. There. And the Damned. I'd go over to London 77 for these three bands and I'd just... Uh, I'd spend all of 77 in London. 78, I'd travel with the Pistols back to America. Watch them split up and laugh um, in San Francisco. And then travel down to, so 
sort of California way for 78. The rest of 78 is start watching like Black Flag and the bands in LA around that time, Black Flag, X, um, The Germs, this came out in 79 on Slash Records. So um, I'd still be in LA with hanging around with uh, the Black Flag and Circle Jerks. 79, I'd sort of go up to San Francisco, although it's not that far from LA. Um, and I'd uh, in San Francisco I'd watch the Dead Kennedys uh, come out in 80 um, and then from 80 I'd think back down to Chicago um, to LA sorry so I could see like adolescents and Circle Jerks play end of 81 I'd get over to um, New York and Washington. Just I'd go to New York just for the Beastie Boys, to be quite honest. But uh, Bad Brains as well, and then get over to Washington for like your minor threats and your uh, teen idols and the whole Discord thing. And I'd basically I'd spend the first part of the eighties traveling around America and just watching hardcore bands, different ones like Corrosion and Conformity, Battalion of Saints. Uh, Vatican Commandos, those types of bands. And uh, yeah, I'd end up in 85, 86. And uh, that'd be it, I'd come back to present day. <laughs> so, um, that's it, that's my response, Robert. Um, keep up the awesome videos, keep up the magic videos, those are cool. Um, that's everything. Oh, I've been listening to therapy in the background. I didn't forget this time. Hooray! Right, until next time. See you later.